It was a hot summer day in Hollywood, California. A group of drag queens were set to begin production on a new season of the popular competition series, RuPaul's Drag Race All-Stars. Your favorite pageant queen is back. Your Miss Congeniality, Yura Drag. No one was more excited than season five fan favorite, Little Pound Cake. The four foot tall legend was back to claim her spot in the Drag Race Hall of Fame. But shortly after her arrival, she vanished. Did the potty mouth beauty queen get cold feet? Or did she meet with foul play? Little Pound Cake was an outsider in the drag world. Little Pound Cake enjoys being a straight up mother pig. <laughs> After being crowned Little Miss Junior Drag in 2013, her brief cameo on Drag Race Season 5 skyrocketed her to fame. Little Pound Cake was unstoppable. All hail Little Pound Cake. Or so it seemed. Contestant Yura Drag was set to compete with Little Pound Cake on the all-star season that never aired. When I came back 10 years ago to compete on Drag Race, I was very excited, especially because Little Pound Cake was my idol. Decorated pageant queen I'm a Fox was also a contestant on the lost season. It's no secret that me and Little Pound Cake had our differences. I didn't like the bitch. The makeup is still terrible, and your boas are chicken feathers, bitch. Little Miss Pound Cake is the greatest. Little Miss Pound Cake is the fan favorite. But no one's talking about I'm a fox. Ten years later, look at me. I'm a bitch still, yes. But I have become a bigger bitch. And that's real growth. Little Pound Cake was scheduled to shoot a confessional interview, but she never made it into the chair. Yeah. Production was halted as security guard Sherry Coleman searched the premises. Would you state your name for our audience? Uh-huh. It's Sharisha Coleman. The Shah is silent. My mom didn't know how to spell it. I'm a former stripper. I used to work down to the Big Booty Bandit on Pride Street in Atlanta, Georgia. I had changed my life over, and I became a security guard. I think Lil Chucky, because I seen the movie. I think little Chucky got her, and he had slit her throat. That's what I think. You mind if I take a drink? Then things escalated following a 911 call. 911, what's your she emergency? Detective Anita Clue went to the all-star set to investigate. Hello? Hey, first of all, this gonna be televised, right? I'm not really a detective. I'm more of a nosy-ass bitch. The nosy-ass bitch quickly made a troubling discovery. Little Pound Cake's personal effects were still at her workstation, including her driver's license, birth control, and oddly, a small calico cat named Evie Oddly. A pussy. And finally, her EBT card. She found her ETB card. And on a Taco Tuesday, she never left the car because she loved to celebrate Taco Tuesday. She liked the, the soft shell with carne asada. That's her favorite with guacamole. And guacamole is expensive, so she's not gonna live without her car. That was weird for me. Investigators were certain that something bad happened to Little Pound Cake. Yura Drag shared her suspicions with the detective. I don't want to throw anybody under the bus. Uh-huh. But I had a conversation. With who? With Ima Fox. And she confessed to me that she hate Little Pound Cake. The conversation between Ama Fox and Yura Drag was captured on a hot mic in the ladies' room. Little Pound Cake is going to ruin us. The world loves her. We gotta get rid of that bitch. Security guard Sherry Coleman told investigators that Ima Fox was willing to do anything to win the competition. I heard that Ima Fox, she said she'll do anything. She eloquent at all, but she ain't eloquent enough for this competition. I think it's eloquent. Eloquent, yeah, you that's said. what it is. You got five dollars. I'm a fox. She, ah, uh, she is a love. True. I love true to me, you know what I mean? She just very, and they ain't eloquent to me. Want some? 
Detective Anita Clue interrogated Ima Fox to find out what she knew. Miss Fox, I heard a recording of you saying you wanted to get rid of Lil Pow Cake. And I'll tell you to your face. I do. She is my arch nemesis. Miss Fox, where is the body? Akiria is the body. Bitch. I'm a fox didn't give detectives the confession they were hoping for. I wanted her gone, and I'm glad she's gone. However, doesn't mean I did it. So forensic examiner Eva Dents was called in to search for clues forensically. I examined stains, smells, sometimes tastes. I also keep with me my stink finger. This stink finger has swabbed, swiped, and sampled every crime scene I've encountered. One sniff of my stink finger, and it helps me examine what I'm looking at. Would you like to smell my stink finger? The forensic examiner made a disturbing revelation. The DNA found on the drag race set, that was the most mysterious part of it all. Oh. For there was no DNA found on the set because dolls have no DNA. Are you sure you don't want to smell my swing finger? Just once. The forensic examiner did find microscopic synthetic fibers belonging to Little Pound Cake. This could be the key to the case. Acting on a hunch, investigators questioned your drag who made a startling confession. All right, all right, let me tell you the truth. My puppy. I had a phone call mm -hmm. from my boyfriend, Luis Fernando, yeah. that he was a ooh, 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 with either pound cake. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Uh, uh, uh. Uh. And that devastated me. I'm gonna kill the bitch. How do I know you had nothing to do with the disappearance of her? Because I am Miss Congeniality. I didn't do anything to disappear little pound cake. It was in my thought because that bloody slut stole my man. But I am not a Republican and I didn't kill little pound cake. District Attorney Effie Lee Bailey was later assigned to the case. Originally, I am from Brooklyn, Flatbush to be exact, because after a night with me, every bush was flattened. I've worked thousands of cases in my long career. This case has more holes in it than Michelle Visage. The story made national headlines. America wanted to know what had happened to Little Pound Cake. A $25 reward was offered for any information that would lead to her safe return. Phone calls poured into the tip line. I saw a little pound cake behind a dumpster in New York City. She was kidnapped by aliens with me. Girl, I was told she is shacking up with Ross Matthews down in Palm Springs. Now, where's my $25 at? You want a tip? Lynn, bitch! Investigators thought they'd hit a dead end. Clue, dense. I have no evidence and no case. How am I supposed to arrange? I have a great rack. That's what I have. So right here. You most certainly do. Okay, first of all, bitch, I've given you enough evidence. And you keep telling me I'm gonna shove that corner up your ass. All right, well, tell me, what do you have? Listen. Besides I herpes. Then a break. While re-examining calls from the tip line, detectives discovered something they had previously overlooked. This is Lil Pound Cake. I would like to report that I am leaving town with a very eloquent stranger. No need to look for me. I'm good. Ah! Detectives traced the call to the security office at the All Star set. I was a su when they said I was a suspect. I'm just securing the premises. I don't know why they put my name in it. You know there are closed circuit cameras all over the premises. It's cameras around here. In addition to the linguistic evidence, fibers belonging to Little Pound Cake match those found on the security guard's uniform. Baby, I was gagged and gooped. But I was gagged and gooped right before coming to this interview. Right, Mr. Cameron, ma'am? I know it was you. There is linguistic evidence against you, Miss. Eloquent. Linguistic, girl. I like, did you eat your sweet? I fried out. I found fibers 
Got match little pound cake in your locker. Bitch, I've been looking for my fiber intake. My system has been out. Bitch, give it back to me. After hours of probing, the security guard came clean. I did it, girl! I did it, girl! I wanna be on all thoughts. I've been on this set every single day, and they didn't pick me. Damn, bitch, I knew you did it. You going to jail now, ho. Damn! Go to jail. Damn! Based on Sherry Coleman's confession, investigators recreated a timeline that told the story of what had happened to Little Pound Cake. That security guard, she thought getting a job on set of Drag Race was gonna be her way into the business. But as soon as Little Pound Cake saw her rehearsing a lip sync on that stage, she ridiculed her and said, you will never be glamour. You'd be provoked, too. What you said? What did you say? Don't you ever talk to me like that, bitch. Or I'll whoop your ass. And that security card vowed in that moment to get revenge. Come on, bitch. Come on. Come on, bitch. She grabbed her. <laughs> she tore her limb from limb. There was polyfill flying everywhere. <laughs> And then, that security guard had to hide the evidence. We found the body, and we closed the case. Ain't that some The security guard was charged with doll napping and illegal possession of Tig old biddies, and was ordered to spend one hour and 45 minutes doing community service. She got what she deserved. I wanted to be on the season of All Stars, and she wasn't elegant enough to be on it. And I'm very elegant, so I had to get her. Well, uh, when I get paid for this, though. I'm a fox, and you're a drag were exonerated, but still can't accept the fact that their season never aired. I'm disappointed because I knew I, I was going to win my season, and I got nothing. But after all these years working hard, now, somebody asked me, do you want guacamole? It's extra. I'm like, yes, and I can pay for extra guacamole. This season not airing is the worst thing that ever happened to my career. I hate Little Pound Cake. She steals people's boyfriends, and she doesn't have the talent. But you know what? I still had love for her. Today, Little Pound Cake has been put back together with new parts, and a new lease on life. See you next Taco Tuesday, bitch. Oh, hey, everybody, it's Michelle Visage. Do you want Emmy-nominated gay Well, then subscribe to RuPaul's Drag Race on YouTube.